This is the second time now in three years that this embassy has been attacked. The last time it was attacked by a drive-by shooter with an AK-47 and you can still see the bullet holes in the building and on the statue. This time it's Molotov cocktails. In the past there have been offices blown up, but even today people lose their jobs. People lose their places where they're living. When we go to the caravans in Miami, you never know when you go back to your car if they're going to be slashed tires. The last time I was there, three of my tires were slashed. These are violent people. These are people who we have to call out as being haters. These are people who are anti-democratic. This is reflective of the right-wing hating Cuban American community that doesn't represent the majority of Cuban Americans in this country. Because whether or not they like the Cuban government, they cannot be supportive of this kind of violence. They cannot be supportive of this kind of hatred. Let Cuba live! Let Cuba live! Let Cuba live!